Let's work them glutes, boys. Booty. Call me Haymaker. Always going big. Yeah, you know the kid. Call me Haymaker. 95 or 95. All right, number one glute exercise for us is the hip thrust. It is a classic. First step is take a pad and you're gonna wanna put it right around there. If you don't have access to one of these, use a yoga mat, a sweater, a towel, anything that's gonna take away the pain from your hips. All right, number one, the king of all of them is the hip thrust. Now, you guys know there's a lot of exercises for girls, but not all of you guys are gonna wanna be out there doing donkey kicks and wide stance squats in front of all your homies. So these are our top three glute exercises. First, we got the hip thrust. You're gonna wanna really work on thrusting. Don't do a half thrust or you're not gonna feel it. This is a mainly a glute exercise. Let's work those glutes, get a big contraction, and thrust through. This one is fancy because it actually tilts back, but what you guys wanna do is set up a bench press sideways, put your back on it, Bring your legs in nice and close and then thrust up your hips. Really work on that extension. Fully extend everything. Use your back and your hips to really squeeze those glutes at the top. Your goal is to squeeze as hard as possible. You don't want to do this improperly or you'll get nothing from it. Don't be a hero. Do just enough weight as much as you need to get a good set in. One of the biggest mistakes I see with hip thrust is that people don't actually extend. Josh already talked about this a bit, but what you want to make sure you're doing is you want to make sure you really thrust out the very uh, top of the motion. This is the biggest common mistake I see is kind of just going like up. We're doing like three or four plates like up, up, whereas where you're supposed to really go like boom. That's where you, you get see all the, the hips squeeze. really lock out. All right guys, so this next exercise is called the glute cable pull through. Not only is it going to actually work your glutes, but it's going to extremely help you with lockout power on your deadlift and your squat. This is an accessory that Josh and myself have been incorporating. A lot of gentlemen in the gym are too afraid to work their glutes. They may think they look stupid, especially this exercise. It may look a little bit weird, but it is extremely important to have strong glutes for posture purposes, for strength, and just everyday life. GHRs, these are the mother of all exercises, even more so than hip thrusts, because these are also working the hamstrings, another weak and vulnerable area for many men. A lot of guys neglect this work. They'll emphasize quad work over everything else. So what these will do is they're gonna really help you maintain that set um, hip position while squeezing your glutes, being able to keep everything tight and really work that posterior chain throughout the exercise. You guys wanna make sure you're dipping nice and low under control, coming up and squeezing those glutes and hamstrings like no tomorrow. Squeeze it all the way home, that's how you're gonna get it. Play with rep schemes. If you wanna add some difficulty, add some bands. Those are our top three glute exercises for men. These are really important. We have been incorporating these throughout shredded strength and this has helped us so much. This has helped us break plateaus and get to the next level. My lockout power is at a new high. My ability to thrust with my squat is at a new high. And I recommend you guys get on this ASAP if you haven't already. Uh, comment below any questions you may have. Thanks for checking us out. Please subscribe, comment, and share. Y'all are the best. Peace. What's up guys, if you're still watching at this point, you're clearly premium members of the Colossus Army and we appreciate you so much. If you guys appreciate what we do and want to have a pivotal role in supporting and bettering us and helping us help other people, you guys can come over here to our Patreon and help donate. There's a monthly donation to help us grow with different pledge levels, with different rewards where you guys can actually get rewards for pledging. And then the beauty of this is this helps us effectively make better videos, get better content and produce improve production quality all through. Throughout. Thank you so much. Uh, any donation would help so much. If not, just keep liking, subscribing, and being awesome. Thanks.